So you are a psychology student. You're either enrolled in this class, maybe you have declared psychology as your major. Either way, you're wondering, what skills does be a psychology student? Do I need going in? Is there something that I'm going to get at the end? So go in. You don't need anything. Just pay attention. Coming out, what would you expect to have as a psychology person? I can tell you that as a psychology person, there's a lot of different things that psychology is good for. There's many different types of um, applications that you can set these to, and there's a lot of different final careers and lifestyle choices that benefit a psychology person. In the context of this course and what you can expect for how it will end your academic career, I think it's really important to know that there's a lot of different things that can come out of being a psychologist. One of the first and most important things is critical thinking skills. Being in psychology tells you really and importantly how to think think of things in a holistic way. You also learn how to scientific method. This directly helps you figure out how to be a more critical thinker. But as you're going through these processes, I think it's also important to remember that no matter the line of work that you're going into, coming out of a psychology class will also give you a really important critical evaluation of resources. You should be able to, by the end of this class and other psychology classes, really understand what it means to look up the right kind of of resources. So not just figuring out how to look them up, but figuring out what kind of resource you might trust versus not trust. So what kind of skills do you think that you have and that you'd be exposed to as a psychology student? Well, honestly, all of these.